Let us start with the main landing gear assembly. There are two main gears, each fitted with a pair of tire wheel assemblies and an oleo pneumatic shock absorber. Each main wheel also has an anti-skid brake. The following are the main landing gear components. The torque links damper. The side stay. The lock stay. The lock stay actuator. The retraction actuating cylinder. And the main fitting. The main landing gear bay is enclosed with outer and inner gear doors. The outer gear doors are attached to the main gear struts and move with the gear. The inner gear doors are hinged at the fuselage and are sequenced to initially open with gear retraction or extension and close at the completion of the sequence. The main landing gear and doors are electrically controlled and hydraulically operated. Nose Landing Gear there is one steerable nose gear fitted with a pair of tire wheel assemblies and an oleo pneumatic shock absorber. The following are the nose landing gear components. The towing fitting. The force stay. The actuating cylinder. The steering actuating cylinder. And the torque link. The following lights are installed on the nose landing gear. Two runway turnoff lights, a taxi light, a takeoff light, and a parking brake set indication light. All of the lights extinguish when the landing gear is retracted. Nose gear doors are fitted to either side of the nose gear well and are hydraulically sequenced to open then close during nose gear extension and retraction. The nose gear is totally enclosed after gear retraction.